Hello everyone, and welcome back to Follity, your go-to channel for the latest updates on the Royals and much more. Today, we have some exciting stories to share with you. From Prince William's conservation efforts to Prince Harry's birthday celebrations, and even a record-breaking sale of Princess Diana's iconic sweater. So, grab your tea, sit back, and let's dive into these royal stories. Let's kick things off with some heartwarming news from Prince William's long-standing conservation campaign. Recently, the Prince of Wales celebrated a massive fundraising boost, and it's all in the name of protecting rhinos and elephants from poaching in Africa. Prince William's Tusk Trust raised an impressive $150,000 to support their ongoing work in preserving Africa's precious wildlife. This includes providing vital support to the brave rangers who put their lives on the line to combat well-organized and militarized poaching gangs. CEO of Tusk, Charlie Mayhew, emphasized the urgent need to support these dedicated rangers, a cause that Prince William himself has championed. Last year, he issued a heartfelt plea after the tragic murder of a leading wildlife ranger in South Africa. But the fundraising didn't stop there. An exclusive gala evening hosted by Amy Green and Gary Green in Bridgehampton raised a staggering $600,000, with a quarter of that sum going directly to the Tusk Trust. Prince William has been a dedicated patron of this charity for years. The gala, with a jungle-themed Fifty Shades of Green atmosphere, featured performances by the talented Grace van der Waal and renowned German techno artist Jan Blomqvist. Amy Green highlighted that the evening wasn't just about raising funds. It was also about bringing people together to support critical causes like anti-poaching, rainforest protection, education, and climate change. It's all about making a positive change in our world. Prince William's commitment to conservation doesn't stop here. He's headed to New York to promote his Earthshot Prize, which seeks innovative solutions to tackle climate change and conservation issues. In New York, he'll attend the Earthshot Prize Innovation Summit, unveiling the 2023 finalists who are pioneering climate solutions. The Earthshot Prize Award ceremony will take place in Singapore, where five winners across various categories will receive $1.2 million each to implement their environmental solutions. Now let's switch gears and talk about some royal birthday celebrations. Prince Harry recently turned 39 while in Germany, and he had a fantastic birthday surprise during the sixth edition of the Invictus Games. Joined by his wife, Meghan Markle, Prince Harry was treated to a heartfelt rendition of Happy Birthday during a sitting volleyball game between Poland and Germany. The crowd's affectionate welcome clearly delighted the Duke of Sussex, who gave a thumbs up while Meghan leaned in with a warm smile. The couple has been actively participating in the adaptive sports competition, which Prince Harry created in 2014 to support injured, sick, and wounded service personnel and veterans. On the morning of his birthday, the Invictus Games organizers also sent Prince Harry online wishes, emphasizing his inspirational impact and the smiles he brings to people's faces. Their birthday celebrations included a visit to the Brauerei Schumacher restaurant in Germany, where they enjoyed traditional German cuisine, including Weiner schnitzel, blood sausage, and sausages. The restaurant even described them as very likable people. It's worth noting that Prince Harry's birthday this year was a stark contrast to the previous year when he turned 38, shortly after the passing of his grandmother, Queen Elizabeth. This time, he celebrated with joy and warmth alongside Meghan and fellow Invictus Games participants. And finally, we have some record-breaking news from the world of fashion and royalty. Princess Diana's iconic black sheep sweater has made headlines by selling for a staggering $1.1 million 
at Sotheby's Fashion Icons Auction during New York Fashion Week. This marks the highest price ever paid at auction for an item worn by the late Princess of Wales. The bidding war was intense, jumping from an initial estimate of $50,000 to a final price of over a million dollars after a 15-minute battle. This sweater surpassed the previous record held by Diana's Victor Edelstein Aubergine evening gown, which fetched $604,800 in a previous Sotheby's auction. Sally Muir, co-founder of Warm and Wonderful, the brand behind the sweater, described the auction as nail-biting, as the price skyrocketed in the last moments. The sweater, famously worn by Diana when she was just 19, symbolized her unique style and message of not conforming to societal norms. It was rediscovered in storage over 40 years later by one of the brand's designers, Joanna Osborne, who stumbled upon it in an attic. This rediscovery added an element of surprise and excitement to the auction, as it wasn't a planned sale, but a fortunate accident. The auction was an extraordinary event that highlighted the enduring power of Princess Diana's influence on fashion and culture. And there you have it, folks, three remarkable royal stories that remind us of the positive impact the royal family continues to have on the world. From conservation efforts to birthday celebrations and fashion history, the royals always manage to keep us captivated. Thank you for joining us on Follity, and don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating updates on the world of royalty and beyond. We'll see you next time.